the first card we got is threatened. Second card we got is reminiscing. Then we have crazy lover. We got fear. We got non-committed. We got boot thing. And then we got playing the field. So Leo, this will be a regular love reading. So y'all just take what resonate and leave out what does not apply. So what I'm seeing is there could be somebody that is pretty much threatened by a person you may be dealing with. And whoever this is, this is somebody that you may have got into like an argument with or a fight, whether this is a a physical fight or it could just be, like I said, a heated discussion with this person. And um, I don't know who this is, but I just felt like there could be somebody that may have threatened your person, especially if you are the one on the side and you got somebody new, Leo. I feel like your ex is intimidated by them. Like they could be afraid of them or whatever, but they also afraid of you being in that relationship with that new person. But I am seeing that this is somebody that cannot get you off their mind. Whoever this is, this is somebody that is very much crazy. Maybe you look at them as somebody who is cr a crazy lover, but I feel like this is more of an ex. Most of y'all could be an ex. Some of y'all are currently um, dealing with this person, and maybe they have like literally tried to threaten you. Um, some of y'all, this person probably threatened to leave you, um, Leah, or maybe this is you. Maybe you threatened to leave them. Y'all take what resonate. Roles can be reversed. But it is showing me that some of y'all are dealing with a crazy lover and they afraid of you leaving them behind. But I feel like you don't want them. This person is afraid of you leaving them behind. You don't want this person. Some of y'all don't want this person. Maybe this is somebody that cheated on you before or you just don't want them. But, yes, yeah, some of y'all don't want them. Like I said, y'all got a new person. Some of y'all got somebody new. That's, a, that's exactly why you do not want this person because you have somebody new that you may love, you may be in love with. But some of y'all are definitely playing the field. Some of y'all probably don't even have, not like, some of y'all not even in a relationship. Some of y'all just have like a new, a new boo. And maybe you've been shacking up with this person or you just been dealing with this person, you know, on a sex-based level. Or you could have just been dating this person, Leo. But it is showing me that this is somebody that's fearful of you moving on and falling in love with somebody else. Because obviously this ex right here, they don't want you to be with nobody. But like I said, y'all exploring y'all options. Y'all playing the field right now. Some of y'all definitely is exploring your options. Y'all doing y'all. But we're going to dive deeper in this situation and see what else is going on. We need clear, intuitive messages, please. Oh, we got the lovers reversed. We got the fool reversed. We got the page of wands. And then we got the Nine of Cups reversed. Yeah, you made your decision to walk away from somebody and never look back, Leo. Some of y'all could be a Gemini or maybe an Aquarius that you have walked away from. The rest of y'all, it could be an Aries that you have walked away from. Or you could have these placements in your astrology chart. Y'all just take what resonate. But it is telling me that you have made a decision to choose somebody else over this person and never looked back and now this person is mad they unhappy they unhappy because you dealing with somebody else like i said some of y'all could just be like a sex-based connection that you in you know like i said you playing your the field but they're not happy over the simple fact that you is sleeping with another person or if you are talking to another person either way there has been some form of extension of an offer whether this is a, a real committed relationship that you could be in um, or like I said, y'all could just be messing around. Y'all take what resonates. But y'all got this ex heated about that. Because like I said, y'all have walked away and never looked back. It's like once you made a decision to choose the new, like your person right there, they just start going crazy. Like I said, they, they just start they just start going nuts. I'm hearing some of y'all's person tried to fight your new person. Like I said, there has been some form of a heated discussion or maybe a physical fight, you know. But... We got palm trees. Yeah, you in another relationship. Some of y'all definitely in another relationship. We got palm trees, stability, security. Yeah, some of y'all left because maybe, like I said, you didn't trust this person. 
Some of y'all, you left because this person did not offer you stability. They did not offer you security. So you walked away. That's exactly what I'm seeing. Maybe you feel like this person was broke or maybe you felt like this person was called. Maybe you felt like this person was causing you to be unstable while you were living with them. Whether they was using you for money or whether they were stealing your money or it could be anything. Or maybe they wouldn't get a job and you just got tired of taking care of all the bills by yourself. But it has something to do with stability and finances. Some of y'all, like I said, some of y'all could have been the simple fact that they was cheating. And now that you have walked away, they mad. Yeah, they heartbroken about you being in another connection with somebody. Your ex is heartbroken about this new connection that you are in right now, Leo. They heard, they heard about this. Yep, you rejected them. Some of y'all person... <laughs> Some of y'all, your ex trying to sleep with you. We got the page of wands right here. And you could be declining. Like, no, I don't want to sleep with you. And it's causing them to be more and more and more, and more upset. Yeah, they, they could be only wanting to um come back because they really want a piece of your, you already know. They just want to sleep with you, period. That's too many. I need one more car spirit. But like I said, they mad because you gave you dealing with somebody else. And they, they want parts of that. They ain't getting none of that. I feel like y'all have already made your mind up. We got karmic relationship. Yep, this person is a karmic. Y'all steady rejected this person. And they steady trying to find an excuse to come back. That's exactly what I'm seeing. This was a karmic. Fleeting. fleeting triggered. They are triggered by you, you rejecting them. I'm just getting this energy where y'all just keep on rejecting this person and they just keep on trying you. Some of y'all, maybe this person just keep coming back. Some of y'all, or they just keep calling you or they keep texting you. It's something like that, Leo. But let's dive deeper in this situation because y'all got this person bugging for real. Whoever this is, this person is not trying to hear that. They they don't want to give up on you. But I don't, I don't know why, but I'm hearing that this is somebody that that has, they feel like you dealing with you. Y'all have great sex together, whoever this is. But you don't want them. Because they sure want some of that, whoever this is. And it's crazy because it's probably not even about being in a relationship with you. They just don't want somebody else to have access to you of what you have. Whether it's sex or money. Or, yeah, the stability. We got distant horizon. Yeah, you dropped this person. Y'all ain't playing. <laughs> Some of y'all ain't playing about this person. Y'all just not playing. It's a wrap. You made your mind up and you're not going back. Yeah, because they was a they were deceitful. You was dealing with somebody who was very deceitful. They still is. Like I said, they probably still doing what they want to do. They just mad and heated over the simple fact that you have replaced them. And they don't want nobody else to have access to you. You know what I'm saying? So it's like more than anything, it's not about them wanting to be with you. It's about you leaving them behind and, and like never coming back because they still non-committal even if you was to bring them back right even if you was to give them another chance they still are going to cheat it's still going to do them and i feel like y'all gonna do y'all too that's exactly why you walked away look then i say they keep calling they keep texting like and hide somebody in the background at that or this could just be you you have your boo in, um, in the background, and they keep calling. But I, I feel like this is them, too. They're just playing a role because they – I'm hearing I want what's mine. <laughs> I don't know. But I don't know why, but I'm hearing, Leo, this person think they own you, whoever this is. They think they own you. Even though they can't do right by you, even though they won't do right by you, I feel like they think they own you, and they don't, whoever this is. Hmm. I'm going to pull some of these, and then I'm going to pull some of those other tarot cards. But, yeah, they keep on calling. They keep on texting you. You know, why they got somebody else in the background? Ain't that something? Why they got somebody else in the background? This is a front. This is They just playing a role because they want what they want, which is, like I said, they just want to have sex with you. They want to have access to you. Some of your person think that sex is going to keep you, but it did not. Whether you're a man or a woman, some of y'all are the ladies that got away. Some of y'all are the ladies that got away. We got, I am better with my mind than my heart. Didn't I say this is somebody It's not even about love? It's about their ego more than anything. Their ego. 
I can't make a decision. Yeah, they don't listen. This person don't want a relationship for real. They don't. Because if you can't make a decision, that is telling you that they're not serious about you, right? No decision is a decision itself, right? So yeah, this per is not it's all out of ego. They ego tripping right now, Leo. They ego tripping. And like, and like I said, y'all already know. I wish I could be fully honest with you. You're yeah, right. One more. Yeah, they ego is yeah, they ego tripping. I guess nothing else. I'm just gonna pull some tarot cards. And it's crazy. I just cannot stop looking at that the false person card that your person literally doing all of this for nothing. That's the crazy part about it. They just putting up a show and acting crazy because they ego hurt. It's not because they love you. It's because they don't want nobody else to have access to you. They got a whole person behind the scenes. That's that's what tripped me out, Leo, is that your person has a whole nother female or male behind the scenes. You got your new boo, but they got a whole nother woman or a whole nother man in the background. What type of stuff is that? You acting like this? <laughs> That's exactly what I'm seeing. We got the nine of wands. Yeah, this person going crazy because you don't want to. Then I say it's all about a sexual situation. This person going crazy because you don't want to mess around with them no more. The nine of wands reversed. This is saying that you was pushing them away. You don't want to sleep with this person no more. They mad. Be, they really mad because you stopped effing them. That's why they really mad. Whoever this is, they're not mad because they love you. Even if they got to think that they love you, they really don't love you. They're just mad because they can't have access to what you have. Yeah, it's over. This person don't know what they want. But I feel like y'all, like I said, y'all got your mind made up. Y'all have laid this situation to rest. We got, I wish I could be fully honest with you. Start it over. Hmm. Some of y'all this person don't know. Some of y'all this person don't know that you have moved on to somebody else. Some of y'all they just don't. It, this could just be you and them back and forth and they keep trying to argue with you or trying to explain themselves about, you know, trying to come back. But I'm here no matter what they say, you just don't want them, period. No matter what they say, no matter what they do, no matter how crazy they act over you, I'm hearing. Like, it's a wrap. I feel like y'all, it's just it's all for play play. This is all for fun. This is all... I'm telling y'all, this is somebody that got a lot of pride and a lot of ego. Like, they just do this just to see if you're going to give in and take them back. That's it. It ain't even nothing like what you think it is. They just want to know if you're going to give in. You know what? Let me pull some of these Oracle cards. They want to know if you're going to give in. That's what they want to know. They just want that. They want those yams. They want those. If, if y'all ain't have sex, if y'all only have sex for real, it ain't even about the sex then. It, it's, it's just they don't want nobody else to have you because I'm hearing that this is somebody that's very controlling. But I'm hearing that they, they also don't provide. So how are you going to control something if they don't provide? We got the solar plexus chakra. This person is all in, this person is all in their feelings for real. They really is. They all in their feelings. They try, I called it out. They, they they just want power. They want that control. That's what they want, but it's over. Some of y'all feel like y'all need to let it go and get y'all mind right. I'm getting this energy where y'all are getting back in alignment. I'm hearing some of y'all are, are going, like y'all getting back to being y'all y'all self. That's what, I'm, that's what I'm hearing for some of my Leos. I feel like I got a bird. But yes, I feel like a lot of y'all are falling back from this person, you laying this situation, you know, to rest, and you moving on. I feel like you're moving on fast, fast. I'm here. I'm. I'm. I'm y'all recovered fast from this person. Some of y'all have recovered, unless you really wasn't that attached to them all like that. Maybe it was just the beginning, you know. And maybe that you realized that it was some red flags with this person, or you just felt like, you know, this is somebody that has you have you have forgave multiple times, and you finally got fed up, you know, and, and walked away. Like a lot of y'all, mind was already made up to meet this person. 
like literally because i'm hearing some of y'all it build up over time and you just got so tired like you know what i'm about to talk to somebody else i'm just tired of this person they doing what they want to do i'm gonna do what i want to do that's exactly what i heard but i was telling you this person still want to hold on they still in their feelings about you they pissed off this is a lot of anger a lot of aggression with them you know i'm hearing y'all put this person in time out <laughs> Some of y'all did put them in time out and they still going crazy. The rest of y'all are done done. The the rest of y'all, y'all are done done. I'm seeing both energies, time out and I'm seeing done done. Either way, time out or done, you still going to do you. Yeah, it's over. They is so listen, when I say this person is sick, this person is sick about the separation. It's it's crazy. Some of y'all just need to fall back. And make change. Most of y'all are falling back and making change, period, and moving on. Some of y'all manifesting new. Like I said, y'all gonna manifest new or y'all have already manifest new. Um, but it is telling me that y'all have moved on. Y'all got y'all got up out of there. We got coffee cup. So I don't know why, but some of y'all, if you're not dating somebody new right now, like I said, some of y'all could just been going back and forth with this person, and this person was just acting crazy. Um, if you're not dating somebody new right now, just know that when you fall fall back from that past situation and you walk away and heal. I feel like y'all going to meet somebody else. And it's going to be more, y'all going to form a friendship first before y'all actually be in a real, you know, genuine connection with this person. But I just keep hearing that y'all going to replace this person real fast. This energy could a little bit be, you know, all over the place a little a little bit. But for some of y'all at the beginning, I did see y'all do have somebody else. Or you maybe y'all were just in the talk, talking stages. But it is telling me y'all could just be friends. It could be that. Maybe you already met the new person and y'all could be in the talks, the talking stages, you know, and, and y'all could be friends. But it's telling me that y'all will eventually have something a lot more serious a later, you know, a little bit later down the line. Yeah, whoever this is, this is somebody that likes you. This is somebody that likes you. Um, I feel like they flirt with you a lot. Okay, let me pull some more cards. Yeah, y'all got y'all got this ex going crazy. Whoever this is, you know, they just like they ain't having it. They is not having it. They ain't playing with you, whoever this is. <laughs> and you ain't playing with them either. Okay. God is not playing with this person. It's it's just so funny. This part is funny to me because they sit here acting crazy for no reason and they got a person behind the scenes, like holding on, to, like they holding on to a whole nother person. You see what I'm saying? Like I said, some of y'all haven't even made anything official yet and they acting crazy. You you are, you only in the talking stages with a new person. Y'all probably haven't even been official. You know, some of y'all is, you know, by the time this person come back acting up like this, the rest of y'all, you just in the, like, like I said, the beginning stages, but Yes, you have freed yourself from something that you was holding on to for way too long. We got freedom. Yeah, some of y'all blocked this person. I feel like you don't need no, there's, you're not giving this person clarity because maybe they didn't give you clarity on why they cheated in the first place, right? And they still cheating. That's the crazy part about it. They're still doing them. And some of y'all probably wasn't actually official with this crazy person. Y'all just probably gave them some butt and they start acting crazy because you, you start talking to somebody else. And they thought they owned you. You see what I'm saying? It could be that too. But they still hold it. I just cannot stop seeing that. Like, every time I look at that car, it just made me think that this person is really holding on to somebody else and they acting up for no reason. You see what I'm saying? Like, that's just, it's, it's just crazy. <laughs> like, they putting up a good act, whoever this is. They, they got some acting skills. Yeah, you closing this situation out and you going towards your purpose. Like, literally. Anything that does not fulfill you anything that is i'm hearing you was watering dead plants some of y'all but listen now you're growing new okay you got new some of y'all it's saying that y'all on the right path so if you chose to leave this person alone and you could be currently dating somebody else right now or you could be actually official in a new con a connection 
Some of y'all, some of y'all on the right path. It's telling me that. Some of y'all are definitely on the right path with somebody new. If you, it ain't nobody new. It could just be somebody you probably already had. I don't know, right? Maybe you just got tired and you just didn't want this person to know, because they was being, you know, they was being sneaky about their little thing in the background. So you probably was doing you too. Some of y'all, not everybody. Intuition. Mm -hmm. Clear intuitive messages, please. I need two cards, here. Some of y'all had a strong intuition about something. Maybe you knew this person was going to come back. Or this person knew something. I don't know. But... Mm. Okay, we got action. So it's telling you that y'all know this person's still going to keep coming back. It, even if things look like die down for a little bit, some of y'all, this person is still going to pop back up. It's crazy. You cannot hear from this person for two weeks and they pop back up. <laughs> some of y'all, it was like this. Some of y'all, it was like this. You was not here for this person for a little bit. You know what I'm saying? And they still pop back up. It's just like they don't want to give up. Like, like y'all got this person. Who she with? <laughs> I can't even say it. Who she with? I'm hearing, I got this person with, yo, whoever this is, they still won't give up. This person is in some form of illusion. I don't know. Maybe y'all did something to this person. Some of y'all probably the one that put something on them. Whoever this is, y'all put some, um, y'all put something on this person. Y'all had to. Y'all did something. I'm hearing the player, the one, y'all, some of y'all put a spell on the player, whether you intentionally did it. Um, I'm hearing you have sexually seduced this person so good to the point they have gained to be very crazy over you. You see what I'm saying? Even though this is a player that's acting up, man or woman, right? Y'all have put it on this person so, 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 so bad to the point where they just cannot leave you alone. They just keep popping up and acting crazy and ugh. I'm hearing the player got finessed. The player got seduced. The player got that thing put on them. That's what happened. We got the Knight of Wands. Didn't I say that? Y'all already know. Y'all already knew this person was gonna come back to y'all. Y'all already knew that. It didn't I say that? <laughs> it said I said it's gonna take listen. Things gonna like settle for a little bit. Like you probably go here for this person for like a couple weeks or a month or so, right? And then they still gonna keep trying you. Look, I told you it was a waiting period. They still gonna pop up. Whoever this is, if some of y'all can be your own baby mom or baby dad, not everybody, but they in some form of illusion that y'all belong together. Whoever this is, this is somebody that feels like y'all belong together. They feel like you they soulmate, but it's also telling me that this is somebody that could be in, like they have some trauma. The reason why they mind is the way it is is because they, they could, I don't know, maybe they traumatized. Some of y'all did. Some of y'all soul shocked this person. Some of y'all traumatized this person with putting that thing on them, whoever this is. But I don't know. I'm hearing somebody has. How many minutes is this? Okay. Yeah, y'all put that thing on this person. I don't know. For them to be a player, they show acting crazy. But like I said, this is a front. I ain't never seen nobody do nothing like that. This, 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 is a, this must be... I'm hearing they, they performing right now, Leo. This person is definitely performing. This person is not to take serious. And I feel like you know that this person is not serious. Or like I said, maybe you did do something to them. I don't know. But we got Yin. What is the yin to yang? The yin to yang. I don't know. This is it's this is the female. I'm hearing they're giving feminine energy. Chop wood. <laughs> y'all listen, y'all leaving them where they at. Y'all abandoning them. Y'all leaving them where they at. Chop wood. Maybe you could be telling this person chop wood or you know, get the F out of here. I'm hearing. Somebody could be 42, 24. 44. But it's like y'all leaving them where they at. 
I'm here. Get the F out of here. Maybe you could be yelling out the window or something, telling this person to get away from your doorstep. Or you could just be saying, leave me alone or something like that. That's crazy. I'm hearing even after some time go by, you, when things settle, when it does settle, you think everything is all good. The person left. They ain't coming back. They still coming back. It's crazy. <laughs> oh, man. They still coming back. Look, round and round. And round. I don't know if y'all can see this card, but this is somebody that just keeps doing the same thing over and over and over again. I don't even know if y'all can see this. It says round and round, but this is somebody that's just, they can't get enough. They don't know what no is. They in some form, it's stuck in some form of illusion. Whoever this is, Leo, like, they just won't leave you alone. But I keep hearing that y'all keep telling this person to kick rocks. Maybe they're getting to the point where they're starting to harassing you. Some of y'all, that is the case where they could be, you know, harassing you a little bit. That's crazy. It's getting too bad. They just keep popping up. Okay, let me pull another one of these cards and then I'm probably going to end it. I don't know. Probably. Willpower. So, like I said, even, I, I'm, I don't know why, but when I see this lady holding both of these, this world and this moon card, I'm getting juggling. They still have somebody else, even though they're trying to make it to get, make it, you know, up with you. And um, I just felt like no matter how tempted you may be to give in, Spirit is saying that y'all are gathering the strength and y'all moving on. Because I just feel like a lot of y'all are, are getting back to being yourself, y'all. Well, maybe you always with yourself, but some of y'all, I just, especially if you went through some things with this person and they was cheating on you, I feel like some of y'all are getting back in alignment. You know what I'm saying? Because some of y'all probably wasn't yourself for a while either, you know? But it is telling me, like, no matter the temptation, you still are, you know, gathering the strength to walk away from this person. Because I'm hearing your well-being may be more important than anything, you know? I'm hearing making healthier choices in relationships, love, you know? And health, everything, some of you guys. But I'm going to go ahead and end it right here, Lee. I hope it resonates. Y'all take care.